can I sell the business opportunity if I'm not making any money? How can I personally get someone to join my business if I'm not making all of this money? How can I talk about making money if I'm not making any money? And I want you to know right now, this is a big mental block that you're having because you think that people are going to connect to the big money and not the small money. And in fact, it's the complete opposite. You know, the masses. I always think about when I'm talking about a business, when I'm talking about building a network marketing business, or when I'm talking about building an online brand, what is going to relate to the masses of people? So let me give you an example. If I sit here and I talk about making seven figures, you might get excited about seven figures, but you might not be making seven figures or you're not even making six figures. Are you really going to connect to my seven figure story? Most likely the answer is no. So when you're sitting here and you're thinking about all this money and how can you relate to someone if you're not making money, it's actually the complete opposite. The masses of people are not making money in a network marketing business. So if you come to them with this opportunity and all you're talking about is making the big bucks, making the big money, you might actually scare them off. So it doesn't matter if you're making all this money. So when I first got started in network marketing, the first two years, I wasn't making six figures. In fact, I was making about $500 a month. And then I ended up spending more than I was making, but I still was enrolling people. I still got customers. But I thought in the back of my head, the reason I wasn't having this massive success in the industry was because I wasn't making six or seven figures. That's not my story. My story isn't strong enough. So that's why I'm not having success. If you can relate to this right now, drop me in the comments. I want to help you break through these blockages that you're having. Break through these brain farts that you think you have to be this freaking huge influencer in order to have success because the answer is no. The simplest person with the most normal life without all of this influence can have success. It's not just for the lucky people. You don't have to be lucky to have success in network marketing. That I can promise you. So it is a myth. If you aren't making money, no one will join you. I want you to write that out. It is a myth to think that if you aren't making money, people won't join you. I want you to take that right now. I want you to write that on a piece of paper. Nope, I need that piece of paper. We're gonna write it right here. This is what you're gonna do, a little exercise. And you're gonna put, if you aren't making money, you can't find success. That is a blockage. That is a story that you're telling yourself. You're going to write it on a piece of paper. You're going to go like this. You're going to put your bad breath on it, right? And then you're going to whoop, throw it in the garbage can that I did not make over there. You couldn't see. I used to play basketball though, so I should have like, that should have been a swoosh. It should have been all net, but it wasn't, okay? I want you to get that stinking thinking out of your head. It is a myth. The truth is your story is impactful. That's what you should be using to recruit. Your story is connection. When people feel a connection to you, not the amount of money you're making, they will join you. But most of the time you're making that blockage because you think you're not making money. So when you come off and you're talking to people and you're not even telling your story, you are telling your story, you're not connecting. So it's impactful. Your story connects and your story relates. People have to relate to you, connect to you in order to feel an impact by you. Yes or yes in the comments. Your story is what sells. But at the end of the day, we keep thinking it's the story of money. It's not the story around the money. It's the story around you. So I'm going to give you three ways to shift that stinking thinking. If you want those three ways to shift that stinking thinking, I want you to put a poop emoji in the comments because it stinks. I just changed a poopy diaper. <laughs> I just changed a poopy diaper. So it makes sense. So we're going to get into that. I'm really excited. Before I get into all that goodness, you know what to do. If you want to win this shirt, I'm giving this shirt away, right? I walk it like I talk it. Yeah. Give me a whoop whoop in the comments if you want this shirt. 
All you gotta do is share this. First of all, you know you have team members that need to see this bad boy, right? There's people that are gonna need to see this because there's people that are not enrolling into their business because they think it's because they're not making money and that's a bunch of BS. A bunch of BS, right? So, you need to share this out. Drop share it in the comments or tag those humans. Share this into your team chats or into your Facebook groups. Completely generic training. You wanna make sure that I help you shift their stinking thinking, okay? So go ahead and share that shared. Everyone who shares this is gonna get into a raffle to win the swag, the new swag that has just dropped, okay? If you are new, this is the first time you're seeing my Foch hello. My name is Marina Simone. I teach busy moms how to slay online sales by leveraging your personal brand and social media to build an online empire where hashtag pants are optional. I want to take more mamas from the cubicle and put them on their own thrones. And you better believe in my new house, we move August 1st, I will have my new throne there. So if you're new and this is the first time you're seeing me drop new in the comments, Betty Bot is going to send you a special gift, my SOS tracker that teaches you everything you should be posting on Facebook. Chip, chip, a little check off sheet. So drop new in the comments as always. Um, for those of you that are not new and you know all about the Elite Academy, the Heels Up Academy, which is my less than $40 a month monthly membership community, the doors are open today and tomorrow only. And we just added something really cool. So these are part of the announcements. We're gonna get into the training. I have notes because I have mommy brain. Um, what's new? Starting August 15th, we are going to have a weekly prompt that comes straight into your inbox that is going to share with you theme of the week of what you could be posting on social media. What can you be posting to get more engagement? What can you post as a curiosity post strategy? I will be in your inbox once a week helping you theme out your week. This is something that's brand new. We are making a serious shift in the Heels of Academy. If you want to join now for the Heels of Academy, I need you to put join in the comments and Betty Bot, J-O-I-N, Betty Bot will shoot you a link so you can get your little butts in there. So this way you can get my daily, not excuse me daily, my weekly prompt into your inbox, okay? This is huge because I think this is what a lot of people are struggling with. Marissa and I were talking about this and what do we get all the time from healers? What should I be posting? How can I use attraction marketing? How can I have my personal branding? How can I really get more people to pay attention? And that's what we're shifting this Elite Academy to be about. You have Marissa in there showing you how we do all things personal branding when it comes to your quote images, when it comes to the cool things you see we do. How do you make your own swag? How do you use Canva? How do you do all the things that create an online brand that attracts people to you? Guys, this is stuff that we pay a lot of money for that we bring to you less than $40 a month. Drop join in the comments and we will get that link to you. Um, there's already $12,000 worth of value in that back office. So let's move into the goodies, right? Three ways right now that we're gonna shift that stinking thinking, right? Best decision I ever made. Lindsay, yes, boo boo. Jennifer says she's so excited. And he go, great idea. I'm sometimes struggling with one. Yes, right? I love that. Bad bet. Yes, theme up, baby Betty Bot. Yes, boo boo. We are going to be theming it up. Betty Bot's going to be in your inbox every week telling you what you be, should be posting, right? So awesome. Let's keep this going. So, number one, the biggest thing. Like I said, is that block. You think if you don't have success, you're not gonna be able to enroll people. And that blockage, that stinking thinking, is what's holding you back. So here's an example. If you're always focused on, I'm not making money, I'm not making money, I'm not making money, I'm not making money, you're gonna continue to not make money, not make money, not make money, not make money, because all you're focused on is no money. We don't want to focus on no money. I wish I had like the gun right now to just make it rain. We want to focus on rain down on me dollar bills, y'all. Dollar dollar bills. Drop me some money signs in the comments if you want money raining down on you. We don't want it raining men. We're good. We're good with that. We want it raining dollar bills. We want to visualize money growing on trees. And so if you're always focused on, well, I don't make money, so that's why they're not joining me, 
then they're not going to join you because that's the kind of crap you're putting off, the desperation you're putting off. You're putting off like, I'm bare, I got a toe in the water. You're not all the way there with your belief in the industry or in your company or in yourself. Therefore, it's coming off that way. You have no confidence. If I can get an amen in the comments, I'll preach in the comments. If you feel what I'm dishing out, it's so important. It's so important that you understand this stinking thinking that you had is holding you back from freaking greatness. I need you to dream of money growing on trees. I need 